I have something to share with you guys. You know, like I said before, the only time I make videos is when something comes to me within myself to put out. I want to talk about thought. And this thought came to me because I am thought, which is the creator. Because the creator is thought, which is pure energy. <clears throat> and pure energy cannot be destroyed. Everything you think, this is a reason why people say when you think something or, yeah, like when you're thinking something, you can actually do it, you believe you can and all that stuff. Because your thought, you're basically the creator, you're a god. You can do anything you put your mind to. That's what everybody always say. That's the correct word. They say that you can do anything that you put your mind to. And your mind is a thought. And that thought is the creator itself. As I said before, the creator was just thought in the beginning. And that thought is pure energy. <clears throat> and it cannot die. Or it, it, it's, it's not mortal, it's immortal. These bodies that we live in are an experience. We separate it from the Creator, which is thought, to experience life on Earth and other universes that's out there. Without a body, if you're just a thought, you cannot, you know, you cannot have a mouth to speak, you cannot have a body to move in or anything because you're just a thought, you're pure energy like a flame, basically but when you are inside of a body, you can control that body you can speak, you can feel, you can touch, taste, smell love all them things like I said before, you have people which is thought, gods you have guys that has a mindset of control. You have others that's lost. You have some that has love within them that want peace. And you have one in particular thought that's close to the source, the true creator. It has this it has the thought of the true creator. This one thought. Just understand that this one thought is on earth as well, which I'll call God. There's one in particular, God. This, I just want you guys to understand what I'm saying. We're all gods and goddesses. But what I want you to understand is, the source, we, we, we separate it from the source to experience life. We are the source. We are all one from the source itself I hope you guys understand what I'm saying we basically spread it ourselves it's like a separation from the creator but we are the creator living our own lives having our own mindset our own thoughts whether you're good or bad or lost or close to the creator think like the creator that's my mindset. My mindset is close to the creator. That's what I'm telling you. The things you, the things that I want, you may not want. The things that you say does not mean you really want it. Just because you're saying it. Because you're so used to this life. When I say something, I really want it. I want to make a change. I want peace on earth. I want everyone to love each other. But it doesn't mean you want the same exact thing just because you speak of it. Because if anybody wants it, they will try to change things themselves if they got the money to do so. You have people that pretend to be like, basically like us, the awakened ones. They pretend, but they're still lost. 
everything you think. For instance, you have people that work out, become super strong, right? And you have skinny people that looks weak. But it's not about what's on the outside as far as how you look, as in how strong you are just because you're ripped. It doesn't mean that you're strong or stronger than someone that's not ripped. You have people that's not bodybuilders or super strong, as in their body looks super strong, but if they face someone that has less muscle, they'll be shocked of how strong that person is because they have no muscle gain. But muscle gain doesn't mean anything. If we knew how to control our minds to become strong, we wouldn't have to work out or anything. If you use your mind to become strong, you will be strong. It's like a force you will feel upon your body that makes you heavy. That heaviness is strength. So it's like what you call gravity, but it's not gravity. You can make yourself strong by thought. This is true. By thinking it. But, you know, they dumb all of us down to not have the ability to do so freely. We have to learn how to do so. I don't know how to do it, but I know it. You see? The reason I know this is because, you see, you do things without you knowing that you're doing something. And it happened to me just now where I felt heavy. And... When you think something, if you know how to control your mind on doing things, you can do anything. You can become strong. You can be the strongest person on earth and you can be the super skinniest person out there, but overpowering everybody, bodybuilders and all. If you look at some videos out there, you got people that's not even ripped, that's not even um, built like someone else is. And all of a sudden, they end up winning a arm wrestling contest or something against somebody that's bigger than them it's not about it's not about how your outside look it's what's within your mindset I just wanted to put this out there for you guys to understand it's all about the mind because the mind is thought the mind the thought is the creator you can do anything that you put your mind to because you are the creator they're not going to tell you this. But they're telling you at the same time. If they're telling you you can do anything you put your mind to. They're telling you that you are the creator. But we're not going to tell you this. But you can do anything you put your mind to. Just think about what I'm saying. A lot of you know I'm telling the truth. Why would they tell you that if it didn't mean anything? It means something. It's way deeper than what they're telling you. Because they're not telling you nothing. All they're telling you is, you can do anything you put your mind to, son, daughter, friend. But do they know what they're saying? Of course they don't. Because people worship God. Not realizing that you are the creator yourself. You just don't know it. That's all I had to say.